Hey folks, technically this is the early video preview, even though it's Thursday evening, we uh, are behind schedule, we've just had so many auctions coming up to this, so this is a last minute auction, not only is this a last minute auction, but it's also a December auction, and it sounds like there might be a snowstorm, so if you can make it, you're going to be the guy getting all the deals, uh, but make sure you at least sneak in here at some point before Saturday morning, check out what's here, because it's a beautiful auction. Uh, we'll start right here, lot number one, uh, Pescafile's favorite end of the mermaid, and we've got these beautiful coat racks here. Um, coming across these TV wall mounts. Um, if you, uh, I'm going to chase you right down this aisle here. We got these uh, wall mounts uh, TVs. We got these beautiful fixtures. They're all through the auction. It's a bunch more. Um, as you're going through, I, I did start where, at lot number one, but you're going to see a bunch of stuff that's not up yet, like everything over here. There's going to be a lot of A lots because, like I said, this is all kind of happening last minute. We're unpacking these pallets. I mean, take a look at this. this these two pallets are just full of small wares that we still need to lay out. Tons of artwork, uh, tons of nice fixtures. We've got uh, some great uh, stuff coming in from dealers. We've just got to scrape their price tags off of it because they don't want you to know they're charging three times what it's going to sell here for. Um, but um, we've got some uh, nice uh, refurbished true refrigeration. We just have to uh, finish cleaning it up, but it's all tested. If it's in the auction, it's been tested, and uh, hopefully it's been cleaned. Um, but I will update pictures at the very last if we, if we get around to cleaning it. It won't be in the auction if we haven't tested it. It's worth it. Um, beautiful refrigeration. We got uh, Imperial uh, Convection Oven, Imperial Six Burner, uh, Hobart LXI on a, on a stand. You don't see those very often. That'll save your back, but you can't put it under a, a standard counter. Um, you've got the uh, Manitowoc ice bin, that's gorgeous, uh, out of the boathouse now, we're starting to get into it. Um, we've got this huge ice bin, I maybe watched the video preview, the thing was full of ice, it closes. Uh, got a couple wine cabinets, uh, preservator, uh, I'm going to sneak by. Um, we've got a brand new 20 quart uh, uh, mixer here, this is Uniworld, this is the hubless version that they made. Um, saves the motor a little bit, um, if you don't uh, run it, maybe last a little bit longer, but it should uh, go pretty cheap. And then we've got this, uh, we can put a quick paint job on this, works great, it's out of the boathouse, 30 quart mixer, unfortunately the only attachment uh, we have for it is the paddle, but it's standard, there's later on there's an, uh, uh, an on can, and that's all uh, standard stuff, I'm going back down this aisle on you, that's all standard, so you can see, you can pull it off the on can, pull the beater off, uh, pull the hook off, and you'll see it's all the same stuff. Beautiful one head cap machine. You're, you're in the early auction, this will come up early in the auction, but it just came in. And this beautiful uh, uh, half size convection oven just came in, so we still have to add it. This digital grinder. Um, so it's all going to be a lot in the auction. Um, you're following me down here. Stop right there and just look at this row. All this beautiful equipment in one row. You got the Frankie, you got the stuff out of the boathouse, gorgeous stuff. Uh, this is a, a even newer uh, uh, coming this way. You got a bun hot water dispenser, this beautiful Curtis grinder, a uh, gorgeous unit. We've got the, uh, uh, who is this? Uh, Mazer. We've got another one of these Lamar Zakas, absolutely gorgeous. We've got uh, KitchenAid, RoboCoop, uh, stuff over here. And then this is a new one for me. I've never sold this uh, small batch um, roaster before. Uh, comes with three components, Google it, it's from a company right across the border, um, it's called the Artisan 6. Uh, I saw the invoice uh, one year ago, it looks fairly used, but uh, one year ago they paid, they were into it for about uh, six and a half thousand, uh, with, uh, you know, all in the duties. Um, we got this beautiful Acme dough roller tested, working great, we put a new uh, coat of paint on it. Another Hobart LXI, this one without a stand, we've got uh, some hot serving wells here, brand new pizza tables. You guys love these, these always go really well. Um, these, I mean, you guys know what they're worth. They sell for half the price everywhere else. I got a ranty at the end uh, about the prices I'm seeing people in town selling things. It's driving me nuts. Uh, so the uh, uh, US refrigeration, that's from us. It all comes with warranty. Um, it, this is our brand, this is excess product. We have two containers coming. And we still have uh, a little bit too much stock of this stuff, so essentially we're just putting it through the auction. We have, so we have the 48 inch standard top, 60 inch standard top, 48 inch mega top. These are the crust ranges uh, from the uh, uh, boathouse. We're going to put uh, knobs on it there. A couple of them fell off the trains, unfortunately. Uh, Hobart 60 quart mixer, uh, Garland combination range. Um, we're not going to have time to clean this up, but I mean, it would look gorgeous if, if we could. It, it, it's, uh, ready to go back in service. So this uh, 
uh, skillet. It's gorgeous. That shouldn't even go in the arm because that just came in today, but I'm going to put it in anyway. Um, should look closer to this. We had time for this one. This is the four burner. We've got the Delfield under counters in the unit. This came out of the boathouse. Cleveland steamer. That was only about two years old. The new condition of it, I'm not sure, but it's in, in nice shape and uh, very clean. We cleaned that one up for you. Um, coming over here, uh, refrigeration still needs to be, uh, it's been tested, still needs to be clean. Uh, this is ready to go, nice 36 inch true display case. We've got a beverage air, this is a two door freezer, a uh, true one door. Uh, there's a one door cooler hidden in there. There's a Vulcan triple door here, some more boathouse stuff, small stuff. And then this big boat, sorry we sold it, uh, couldn't risk having to uh, pick this up and move it all around. The guy's going to come get it tomorrow and look at that, we need it out of our way. Thing is huge. Took an offer of twelve hundred dollars. I'm sorry if it breaks your heart, but hopefully you didn't want to pay that much if you were uh, looking for it. Uh, Eighteen inch char boiler. This is actually a uh, return from a customer. Uh, this is what it looks like after you put the face on it. A lot of people don't have the power of imagination, so I'm kind of glad it's here. Um, but this is what it looks like. It looks gorgeous. He's got it on a dolly. He's got it on. Uh, he put this nice front on it. I assume it matched his cabinet, or he just used a spare piece. But either way, it looks great. Um, came back. We tested it. Uh, it's still working great. It's only, he only took it a year and a half ago. Uh, but one of the lights are gone. I don't know what uh, happened to it, but he took out one of the lights. Other than that, beautiful, ready to go. Uh, some boathouse, uh, this is one big lot of electronics, which is going to sell just like that. Uh, I think it's a bit dated. Um, then we've got uh, really high-end furniture all throughout. Uh, and more over here. These are brand new chandeliers in the box, they never used. They were actually for a different store, but they ended up getting uh, put in the boathouse at Horseshoe Bay. Uh, High-end patio furniture. This is all gross flex. These are uh, quite nice, the solid ones, and then there's a slat on the back here. And then we've got the uh, Crest stainless to match their cook line. This still needs to be tested, um, so you might see a piece or two turned around when you come to the auction, but we'll try and get that uh, all in for you. We got the brand new ingredient bins, we got some more clear up stuff at the end. You saw those pallets, all like there's two full pallets of, uh, of really high end small wares, really heavy duty aluminum cook box, really heavy duty aluminum stainless steel, platters, more uh, good stuff like that, and I'll have that all laid out. And I think we're done with the auction. It probably should end up around 400 lots, we hope 500, but uh, the, our storage warehouse is just full up because we don't have time to process everything. But we're back into our showroom here. Oh, yeah, and this Hobart, that just came in. We tested that quickly. That thing's, that, that thing's working great. Um, so now we're into the showroom here. Um, speak to Derek on auction day. This is all our, our regular stuff. We've got a, a few more uh, sizes of this on display for you, but of course we have a warehouse full of those. The only size uh, that's still not in regular stock is 52 inch, but we do have a couple left. Um, he's got some really high-end leasing items, but I want to just rant to you for a second about this. This brand Radiance, my god, some dealer in town, we get, we get them from the leasing returns, we see the price that was, they paid on it originally, and it's like $19,000, $2,000. Radiance is an economy brand out of Korea. My god, don't be fooled. It's, it's every bit as, as bad as Chinese or, or really, really lowest end USA, and people are paying top dollar, they're almost paying Quest money for it. So whoever's doing this is a crook, stop giving them your money. It's really, it's really bothering um, me. We got a nice whole bar 24 up here. We have uh, these high-end espresso machines. We've got a few more of those coming in. We've got some small wares there can help you with as well. Some of which I'll, uh, if there's too much, we'll, we'll tag on to the very end of the auction. Sorry, I've got a cold, but um, that is the uh, deal. Uh, December 10th, Saturday, 10 a.m. You're probably not going to want to be here in person, but if you are here, it's gonna, you're going to be the guy grabbing all the deals, I'm, I promise you. Unless you're uh, at home in your underwear uh, getting them all. Anyway, thanks. Bye.